Excavator 3 4 case. This is an old version of Cyanomac 25 ton excavator in overhaul. After finished all the installation of all hydraulic lines, it was found that rotary has failed. As we know, the excavator rotary action is based by the energy conversion of the rotary mechanism. Start the engine and turn on the pilot safety switch. Operate the pilot joystick for rotary action. The pilot pressure oil pushes the swing valve inside of the main control valve to move. Rotary oil passes are connected. The hydraulic oil enters the rotary motor. The hydraulic energy is converted to the mechanical energy and then output to the rotation torque. At the same time, the pilot oil through the shadow valve into the rotary motor SH oil port of time delay valve, push the valve port to move, open the time delay valve PG oil pass. The pilot pressure oil directly into the bottom of rotary motor brake piston from the pilot valve group, overcome the spring pretension force, push the piston upward, make the brake separation sheet and friction disc separate to achieve the release of the brake and motor rotation. According to our principal analysis and inspection, we can confirm that the motor main oil circuit is in good function because during the rotation, the obvious overflow phenomenon of hydraulic system appears. We can also feel high pressure oil passing through from the motor inlet hose. So, where is the problem? We can see from PG oil pass of the motor delay valve that oil pressure is still normal. But when we dismantle the time delay valve SH signal oil hose, we can find the oil pass was blocked. The SH signal oil circuit of this old 25 tar excavator is from pilot valve into the main control valve through the shadow valve. And then from oil pass inside of main control valve to straight working valve. And then the oil port from upper part of straight working valve is divided into two ways, which transmit the pilot pressure to the automatic idle pressure switch. And the other way is connected to the SH signal oil port of time delay valve. If the SH signal oil hose has no pressure, the pilot oil of the PG oil port cannot enter the motor brake. That means the motor brake cannot be released. There is a temporary solution to this problem we could give a shot. First, remove the SH oil hose, and then use the PG oil hose directly connect to the SH oil hose outlet joint. Start the engine, use the oil pressure to recoil your inside of straight working valve, and then restore the normal connection of the pipelines. As we can see from the video, after oil outlet of straight working valve was recoiled with oil pressure, the blockage phenomenon disappeared. The oil supply of SH oil outlet returned to normal. The excavator rotor fault was eliminated. Of course, this is just an emergency solution at the scene. In case of such failure, we still need to fully investigate the reason of oil pass block.